for a minute. Ain't too bad. Right. Ooh. Right, so that's the first go. Second go. We're ready. Oh, she's nearly, nearly. Oh, nearly. Yes. There she is. Second try, lucky every time. Let's get some ventilation in here before it starts uh, getting too uh, too smoky, too uh, too smoky in the old cabin. Because uh, if you've never driven an old car, you won't know that um, that these are really really bad for sort of exhaust fumes and uh, sort of petrol fumes coming into the car. Um, yeah, really really bad for it. Um, might be because there's a hole in my exhaust on this one, but I am yet to put a new exhaust on it because I haven't found anyone that I, I trust with the car, if I'm honest. So if you've ever wanted to know how hard it is to start an old school 50 year old Cadillac, that is how hard it could be. But that was quite an easy one that time. Um, the battery's nice and fresh, it's pretty much charged right up. Yes, I do use a Unipart battery. Um, I do need to split charge the car, if I'm honest, but the only thing with me is I need to hold the revs up a little bit um, when I first start it up. It does have a choke, but sometimes it doesn't really like the choke, so you have to sort of, you know, help it get going um, when you do start it up. But I'm really, really happy with it, actually. Really, really happy with it. And I've just noticed down here, see, this is how bad it is. I still have, if I can get a blood thing out. Yeah. That is the receipt for my player's ticket. See that? <laughs> players, Friday the 15th of July. Bloody hell, that's bad, isn't it? Just shows how much I don't use this car, that's insane. Absolutely insane. And there's a tax disc in here as well. From when I bought it, oh my God. And some sunglasses that I've been missing. That's all right then. Found my sunglasses, that's good. She's still clean in it though. I'm really, really impressed with how clean it is. Where it's um, sort of in a in a garage now, it really, really, it doesn't get all musky and horrible, which is quite nice. So, quite happy with that. Right, I'm gonna sit you outside and see if the air ride's working. successful trip don't you <laughs> quite impressed with that we went a hole from here to over there so we did well we didn't break down either which was fantastic 
so doing well today we're doing well so yeah more people wanted to see a couple of bits of this car so I thought I'd do this little video you know just to show you all what it's like to start and you know I just needed to start it up and move it around a little bit just to um, just to free it up and make sure it was all right and it's you know nothing's really catching the brakes are still fine you know and as you can see from the time lapse I just did it's a fucking nightmare to get reversed in because literally if you're looking at it like this you can't see the back of the car so you do have a point where you can see this bit but from here so from here you can't see that can you let's be honest so yeah a little bit hard to see but that's as close as I want to get it today but yeah I'm still bloody happy with that so hope you like the video guys um a little bit of a I don't know start up tour of the caddy I suppose I'm going to call this starting up the beast because she is a beast and it does take a while to start it up the battery's been on charge for three days so um says a lot about how much cranking power this car actually needs to uh, start going so yeah, I'm happy with it though, it started up pretty well and uh, moved around the garage quite freely which is nice um, so a couple of things I need to do before show season and stuff obviously I'll be at players if anyone's there um, you know I'll try and um, I'll try and make sure I've got stuff with me as well um, I've got probably four or five months though so hopefully I'll have a couple of bit more bits done to the caddy um, and hopefully I can come and meet you all um, that would be fantastic and you can all meet the car as well I think a lot of people actually want to see this in person and um, you know will realize how big this car actually is because I think from pictures and from videos I don't think people really get the size of this car it's pretty fucking big 19 foot long so yeah so guys hope you like the video make sure you like share and subscribe and I'll see you on the next video cheers